I think if you look at the Northern Cape, it is not just the next mineral province of South Africa, it is probably one of the richest mineral provinces in the world. The mineral resources are there, the people are there, but the people need skills to be able to, in this modern era, drive the mining advancement that we need. There's a severe uh, shortage of skills in the mining sector in our country and in the region. And the reason for that is that people don't view the mining industry as a, a funky industry. You know, they don't see all the potential jobs that are available in this industry for them. And that is why we have the skill shortage. If we look at the economic cost or and benefit, I, I would phrase it in the following manner. If we don't do this, we won't have a business. Uh, we have a business that's got a 300 year plus life and we need to lay the foundation for the next 300 years. We have the minerals, we have the people, but if there's no skills development, uh, we will not be competitive and we will not develop our business or the whole area to its full potential. If we don't pay attention to skills development and, and, and also uh, bridging that gap between grade 12 and university or technicons, then I don't think that this mineral province will develop. That's where South Africa's biggest problem lies from, from our perspective as industry. And that's not to say that we don't need people with degrees and diplomas. Yes, we need more of them. But there's this whole gap in between them that we need to train and pull into the formal sector that will benefit the formal sector and then eventually also feed the universities and technicons. And without that, this mineral province will go nowhere.